But what are we here for? We're here to wake up. That's all we're here for. And that means, on the one hand, challenging everything we think we believe, which 99% is an illusion. They're made up ideas or made up emotion or memories or things that other people told you. They're not real. There's, there's no reality to it. It's like reading a book and saying that's life. Well, no, that's a tiny little tiny piece of life. Life is out there. Life is motion. And in that challenge, when you start challenging your own, your own beliefs or challenging what you've been told or what you've been led to believe as truth and, and facts and important things, they aren't. But the vast majority of people will go along with what they're told, irrespective of what they know inside. When people challenge their own beliefs, it's scary because that's their comfort zone. You're going to challenge the, the foundation you stand on that your whole life is built upon, and it's scary, and, and they don't want to do it, and they run from it, and they flee from it, and they go into mediocrity. They get into a bureaucracy where they don't have to think, or they get, they get on a government dole where they don't have to go out and do anything, and, and they can just exist and stupefy. Now, a real-life person like da Vinci or Ford or Keeley or Tesla, these people were alive. They were out there movers and shakers. Steve Jobs changed the world. And he even said that. You can change the world. Who said you can't? Get out there and do it. And so it's to those kinds of people who challenge the status quo, who challenge the dogma and doctrine, and the BS that we've been pounding in our heads and in countless ways and forms. Uh, those are the guys I dedicate this to, because those are the guys who deserve it. And they made this possible. If Ford hadn't have been one of my heroes, and Casey, and Keeley, and I just listed right down the line, the accomplishers, the doers of, the, of history, if it wasn't for them, I'd be sitting in a nine to five in some university, bored to death, trying to teach math to a bunch of kids who didn't pass grade school, because nobody fails today. The snares that hold us back in our minds and our hearts is, is legion. And we have to challenge those. We gotta say, no, I'm gonna do this. You know, I'm doing it. I'm not gonna do it, I'm doing it. And I don't have to ask anybody's permission.